G'day guys and welcome to this brand new series of Factory Town Tycoon. So I'm going to put some music, some uh, in-game music on here, just so you, um, so you can know that it does have music. It's sort of relaxing. It uh, sort of fits what it is. Okay. So this is a new game, this is going to be a new series for my channel and um, this is going to be sort of part one, an introduction uh, and we're just going to go through the tutorial for this first introduction because most people don't do the, the tutorial quests in games, they just click past it and then they end up running around and not knowing what to do and asking everybody one, you know, later in the game. So I'm not going to do that, I'm going to run through the tutorial quest and it's going to be the first part of the series. Okay, so it's a, it's a new game, it's uh, been in development since last year, as far as I can tell by the, the home page. Um, and what it is, is you just build. Okay, you've got a number of things. You've got your own plot of land. It's, it's not like the normal tycoons. It's set up similar to the normal tycoons, but you create your own layout of your factory equipment and whatever it is you, you want to build from what I've seen. Okay, so we're just going to go through this tutorial quest, and uh, here's the first tutorial. Okay, so we can talk to any of these NPCs, uh, and follow the arrows, and we'll get $10 just as a reward for doing this. Okay, so there's obviously another couple of them down that way, but uh... There's one right here, so I'm going to go right here. Um, okay, so the quest of the basics. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to use the, the axe to cut down one tree. Okay. So here's my axe. And it's uh, looking pretty basic. And we're going to go follow this arrow and cut down this tree. Okay, so we just click on it. Okay, we're just going to keep clicking. Now obviously, we can upgrade these axes and whatnot. But with any tycoon sort of game, you start at the bottom and work your way up. Okay, so we cut down the tree, and now we've obviously got to cut down um, logs, so we'll just chop the branches off. Okay, we've done that. Now we need to chop a log. And so we, we, we need to make some fire logs out of this one. Okay. Okay, grab the fire logs by clicking on it with empty hands. So we've got to put our axe away. So now I've got the logs on my shoulder, because I'm strong. Okay, so sell the fire logs in the town. Shop is near the blacksmith. Fire logs on the shoulder. Click on the shop. Okay. So we follow this here. Okay, so this game looks like it could be really, really good. 
Okay, we got what have we got here? We got oh, we can buy logs for fifteen pillars for twenty five point five planks for twelve. Okay, we can also buy it looks like a whole oak tree. We can buy bricks. Okay, we've got wooden frames, iron frame, uh, motors, and ingots. Okay, what have we got here? We've got, looks like a dig site, so we can dig clay. So there's a lot of stuff we can do in this. I'm just going to follow this arrow, because I'm doing the tutorial. And I do have a little bit of a... Uh, blocked sort of nose at the moment. Got a bit of hay fever. So there's what we can sell. And it looks like looks like the bed's worth uh, almost, almost the most. But we've got a motor here that's worth almost $200. What's this place? This is looks like a nail shop. Okay, sell fire log for fourteen dollars. Okay, so we just made an extra fourteen dollars. Okay, now we need to follow the arrow, so We need to repair our axe. So hold the axe in the hand and we can repair it. Okay. Okay, so now we can um, we've fixed our axe. I suppose this is the damage. We get, I wonder if we can r repair it again. I don't know how much money I've got. I've got 168 gold. Okay, so if we press Q on the sharpening table. Is that what it is? I think it's just, it's already repaired. Finished base building um, quests. I don't know if we can do the base building quest. We could probably try. Okay, so if we click if we've done that, we'll go to the base building. Okay, one or six. Get a plot and build a sawhorse. See build button when you're inside your plot area. So I've got to go and get a plot. Um, okay, so where are the plots based? They must be back this way where we started. We've got a palm island out there. Okay, this looks like an empty plot, so... How do we get a plot? Okay, plot is available. Okay, plot. And a plot. I wonder if I have to buy land. Okay, I'll press 
B, this comes up. Buy, okay, so we can buy. Okay, now what did we need? We needed to make a sawhorse. Okay, so we'll click on that. We need one log and six firewood. Okay, so these are all the sort of stuffs that we can we can make. Oh, okay, open building panels. Okay, we're not interested in that. I just want to build the sawhorse. So we need a log and. I click on the sawhorse and click build I can put it down somewhere let's put it right here okay okay it tells me to put it there but that's obviously pointing to my plot so now I'm gonna have to go and cut down a tree so this is the closest one If I can just cut a branch off. Okay, so we do have night and day cycle. Okay, that works for me. Let's put it on my shoulder. Oh, that's a bright sun. Run back over here. Okay, so let's put it into there. And now we need to grab some more. Okay, there's another log. put this over here and I'll chop it up over here okay can I put that down okay that's cool and now I just want to chop that into firewood okay and now we need to put that in there too click on that Okay, so we've done that. Okay. So we need to go and get another log now. Place the log on the sawhorse. And hit the log with the axe until it turns into a pillar. Okay, so I'm going to leave that on the screen this time. I don't know if I can chop any of these down. Okay, so it's not going to allow me to do that because it's somebody else's tree. Okay, I only, I only chopped a branch off of it. So that's a bonus too. So if you're chopping down your tree, no one else can really grab that tree. Or parts of that tree. If you chop the whole thing down. Now this game does have anchor cheat on it as well, so let's chop into this trunk now and see what happens. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I grabbed the log and I've got my axe still in my hand. Yeah, let's put that down. Okay, I don't know 
what it's pointing over there for. But anyway, now we need to get our axe. And we can chop this into a pillar. But will it? Just press F and it will chop it. That's cool. Okay, so we've got our pillar. And now I must go and buy some nails from the blacksmith. So I have to go all the way to the blacksmith. Now I'm not sure if we can eventually make our own nails. But that's something that I'll probably want to do. So we're just going to run over here real quick. And we'll get some nails. We'll go and have a look at the store later on. Probably do that off camera. Um, So I bought nails that cost, I don't know how much that cost me, 20. Okay, so I need a, a log crate. Uh, nails, 10 nails for 30. Um, I'm going to buy... I'll just take the 10. I'll take the 10 for now. This is tutorial quest, of course. Okay, so eventually I'll um, earn enough money and I'll be able to buy my own horse and cart and I'll be able to pick up the whole tree okay so what do I need to do here let's just drop the nails uh, let's go to the build menu and we need to build a logs crate keeps the materials organized saves content after you disconnect Okay, so that's a good thing. Okay, we'll click on build and we're just going to put one of them right beside our saw horse because it would make sense. Okay, and we need nails for them. So if we pick up the nails and put them in there. Yeah, that's the nails. The nails obviously stay as a box so we can just drop them and we need two logs and one of these so we'll get one of these pop that in there and now we need to go and get our two logs the rest of the trees despawned so that's a bit of a bonus too I suppose to a point because it um, doesn't allow lag to be created. Okay, so we'll put that in there. Now we need to go and cut down another log. So I need my, my axe. And it's getting damaged. So most likely I would probably repair that when I'm buying nails. Hopefully it's good enough to chop this. Okay. 
Okay. Put that on there, and that's created now. Okay, so number five of six, unlock recipe, electric saw. See button add new from recipes. Okay, what's this over here? I don't know. The buildings menu. So we go to the buildings menu. Um, is the add new? Okay, so we can unlock these, and these cost money as well. So we've got uh, the saw. Okay, it's going to cost us $25. Now we can build an electric saw. Okay, so we need to click on the build. So we need four of these pillars and five nails. We still have, we should still have nails, enough nails. So, okay, and I'll put that there. We'll pick up our nails, put our nails in there. We can drop our nails now we just need four pillars so if we can cut some more logs I need to repair my axe um, I'll quickly run and do that now that's gonna cost me $30 They have 163 gold. I would like to buy another better axe. So we're going to quickly run into the store. I'm just going to have a look at the prices of the axes. Since I've got that money. Okay, so we've got we don't have enough to buy a bronze axe yet so we're gonna have to just deal with this we're gonna have to get this sharpened okay um, can we pick this log up somebody else that has their name above it okay that's how you know it's somebody else's okay so the the crescent is for dismantling and moving your items on your plot Trunk's so big, it's probably probably takes a long time to cut. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the branches, and that way the tree won't despawn. And. I already have a log right there. Okay. So we've got two of them here. And they both have my name on it. I can only pick up one at a time. So that's why when you get the chance to get a cart, get the cart. Okay, so... I can do this now from back here no I need to be closer to it I need to chop these yeah so I'm just gonna place those in there Okay, 
they're running backwards and forwards. This could get annoying. Grab this one, place it in there. And I'll go and cut some more. We only need another two, I think. Yeah, so the, the branches cut a bit quicker with the stone eggs than the trunk does. So I need four pillars, so there's, put that in there, and I'll go and get one more and then we can start doing the quest. Cut this branch off. You can't super click fast just to get it. You need to wait for your, um, your little icon to come back. All these logs I'm carrying, I'm going to get super strong. Okay, so now we can start putting them on here. And okay, you can go a little bit faster on this. We'll cut them up one by one, okay. We we'll take the pillar and we'll pop it in there. We'll grab a log from there, put it on there, and do the same thing again. Okay, so notice the damage on the X axis dropped with every every log. Last one. Okay, so I think everything cuts, it drops its damage. Okay, that's the first tutorial done. We have a uh, electric saw. Okay, so you go into the build menu and you can build other items. But, and we just need to add a new recipe every time we want to build something new. We go in here, we unlock it. We gotta have the money first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish this tutorial here and uh, I'll see you in the next one guys. Okay, this is the first part, the tutorials. Thanks for watching and we will see you next time. Bye bye.